Hello, what is up my armadillo army? Once again, this is none of the videos I have planned. Uh, I'm sorry I've been dead for the past few months. Uh, I've been at my grandma's. Um, but it's midnight now and everyone else is asleep and I'm actually not about to pass out for once, so I finally have the opportunity. Welcome to the uncucked take on Dave Rubin. Uh, basically, for those who don't know, Dave Rubin and his husband, uh, basically got a surrogate to have biological kids, and the right is attacking them because of the whole one, uh, kids need a mom and a dad thing. However, I argue that this is not only hypocritical, but also uh, generally a selfish thing on Dave Rubin's part because Dave Rubin is a conservative and the conservative position is pro-life, which argues that unwanted children will be adopted. Hmm. Now, who are the prime candidates to adopt? Well... It's people who can't have kids on their own, so infertile people and uh, LGBT couples. And so, from that position, it is not only hypocritical, but also selfish to intentionally deny a child in the system a home and go out of your way, pay a shit ton of extra money, just so that you can have babies. Which I'm sure there's a way to adopt babies too. And you might argue, oh, the adoption system is so hard. It's so hard to actually, especially for LGBT couples. My argument is that if you're not willing to go through the hard process to adopt a child, then you shouldn't be a parent. Like, there's a reason that animal shelters have adoption fees. It's because if you're not willing to put in the investment for the animal, you shouldn't have that animal. And this isn't just for LGBT and infertile people. I think having biological kids in general is quite the selfish thing to do. I don't agree with it. I don't agree with it for anyone, but especially for people who can't have kids on their own, to go out of your way, because it can't be an accident at that point. Like, to, like you have to intentionally do this. You have to think about it and invest and very intentionally do this. You have to intentionally deny a child in the system a home. And to me... That is selfish. That is an incredibly selfish thing to do, and I don't agree with it. So Dave Rubin is not only generally selfish here, but also especially hypocritical. Like, the, the main argument from the left is like, oh, you know, this is what he deserves for betraying his community. This is not only what he deserves for betraying his community as an LGBT person, it's also what he deserves for being fucking hypocritical, not only hypocritical, because I cannot fucking stand hypocrisy. Literally, like, if you make no effort to be consistent, I don't respect you at all. Not only hypocritical, but also just generally selfish. I think you kind of deserve that, too. So, very hot take, but I don't give a shit, <laughs> because... I'll probably tell this story later, but so far, everyone who's disagreed with me lately has been a dumb shit, so that's just made me a lot more confident and a lot more bold in my beliefs, which is probably not the best thing. Uh, hopefully, I'll move back within the next two months, so you'll start seeing more uploads from me. Also, I got to 34 subscribers when I was at 28, so thank you for that. I might lose some subscribers for this, that this might be the peak, or I might gain some, you know? Anyway, have a good day.